So welcome to this very easy hackerun uh, challenge and we're going to be solving it immediately in very few minutes. Now, well, way back in time, uh, some years ago, I tried to solve this problem using loops. But let's see what the problem is all about first. It says, given five positive integers, find the minimum and maximum values that can be calculated by summing exactly four of the five integers. Then print the respective minimum and maximum values as a single line of two space separated long integers. I have the array, you want to find the, the, the minimum sum that can be uh, calculated by summing five of these items and the maximum that can be found by summing, uh, uh, summing uh, five, uh, five of this item as well. Is it four or five? So it's going to be four, exactly four. So way back in time, I used loops. <laughs> so, so I used loops to loop through. And for each loop, I'm taking four items, I'm finding the sum, the minimum sum, I'm finding the maximum sum, and then <laughs> that. It actually uh, passed uh, the, 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 uh, the, 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 it, it passed the test cases, the sample test cases, but then uh, the performance was terrible. So the easiest thing to do is simply to sort it. Uh, when you sort it, you simply take the first four, that gives you the minimum, and the last four, gives you the maximum. So it's just as simple as that. So in that case, you uh, do it in order of, uh, in constant time, basically. And that's what exactly uh, you are required to do. So I'm going to say ar.sort, uh, I'm using Python. So I'm going to sort it. And then the minimum is simply going to be mini is equal to sum of arr for items zero to four. In Python, the last index is not inclusive, so it's going to be 0, 1, 2, 3. So it's going to be four items, and the maxi, maximum is equal to sum of ARR. Uh, it's going to be now 1 to 5, okay? So that's basically it, and you are, you are expected to print it out as space separated. Now, that these are another that in this way. So these are another thing you want to get in mind. So, I'm going to show you how to print using the format. So I'm going to print. Now I'm going to say F, and now you want to specify the items you want to print inside here, space separated. So I'm going to say mini and space, sorry, mini space maxi. Okay, so this is basically the solution to this problem. <laughs> so this is how easy it is. You don't have to use a loop. So it's basically uh, uh, think order of log n time. Uh, because of this sort that happens here. So let's submit and then let's run and then submit and then let's see what happens. So it works here. So I'm going to submit the code and also it passes all the test cases. So I'm going to be stopping here. Uh, I'd like to give you a big thumbs up coming this far. Don't give up, keep working. I get uh, more challenging and later it gets easier. I remain kind to the tech pro. Please remember to subscribe to my channel and also please leave me a comment if this has been informative for you. And we see in the next challenge.